So recently, I got a text from my mom saying that she wanted to send me gourmet snacks. Um, and of course, I got so excited. I was like, um, yes, of course. If you want to send me gourmet treats, uh, yeah, send them over, girl. So I was like super excited and like couldn't wait for these snacks to come. And I was talking to my mom and then she sends this. I said, thanks, I'm excited to try them. And she says, you will think some is fun. <laughs> so uh, I got a little sus and she said that I should be. My mom said nine snacks or treats are coming and they're supposed to be gourmet delicacy, like awesome treats that got really good reviews. I got two today and I think I'm gonna open them up every day that they arrive. So I'm about to do a lot of outfit changes in this video, um, but I'm so excited. This is like Christmas every day, getting a new snack. So let's go and open up the first one and see if this is a prank. My mom said some of them I should be sus of, so maybe not all of them will be bad, but I'm nervous. Ready? What is this? What? called poop like a champion ultra fiber cereal oh my goodness the back says five steps to pooping like a champion and they list it it says just one serving of poop like a champion contains 84 percent of your daily fiber you can even get more with fresh fruits and veggies beans and whole grain rice hydrate 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 constipation often comes from a dehydrated colon, so when it comes to movements, drinking at least eight glasses a day is one smart move. Get your exercise, get moving to get things moving. A little light exercise like a daily walk will do wonders. Put, put poop on a schedule. Your body's clock wants you to be wants you to go on time. When you feel like going, go before things dry up and get hard to move. Try and go at the same time every day, like after breakfast. And then it says relax. Stress can grip your body from head to bow. Take a little me time to chill out every day and your body will give you a little more go time. Well, I don't really wanna like put it in a cereal. I think we should try it dry. Like I think we gotta get the full experience, the full taste. Um, oh. This literally looks like gerbil food. Like this looks like what you feed your hamsters or something, Why? I, like, okay. Oh, it does not smell good. It does not smell good. Okay. I don't know how, I don't know if this would taste any better in like milk, honestly. So here we go. Bottoms up. I'm going to grab a few. Or we're just going to. Honestly, you guys, review time. It doesn't taste as bad as you think it is. It literally tastes nothing with a slight, slight hint of cardboard. A slight cardboard, no flavored, um, little stars is my review. Next, oh, there's three things in here. So this is called Chimes Ginger Chews. I've never tried that before, but let's try it. Um, can't be bad though, right? If it got all good reviews. Oh, oh, this is not what I expected. Okay. How did my mom even find these products? <laughs> I'm like, how? She must have done a lot of Amazon searching. Okay, this doesn't look that bad. It just looks like a, a taffy, like an all match around, like. There's like powdered sugar, I think, or something, and it's kind of sticky, like caramel. Let's try this ginger chew. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, whoa! <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, it just gets stronger and stronger. Whoa, oh. Oh, it's just stronger and stronger and stronger. Oh my gosh, it doesn't stop. This is ginger chew, like 100% my throat. It's kind of burning, honestly. Like, 
The flavor is so powerful. All right, let's move on to the next one. Ooh! <gasps> okay, this this has to be good, guys. Haribo World Mix. Okay, I love this brand. Like their gummies are so good, and this looks so yummy. So, oh, it's slightly open. Um, let's let's try it. Oh my gosh, I can already see this being gone within a week. So Spencer will find it. And he will eat all of it. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta hide it. I gotta create like a secret stash. I'll give this one to him and I'll keep this one. <laughs> okay, wow, I don't even know what to try first. There look like so many good things. I know that these Coca Cola bottles are already a bop. I've tried them before and these little berry things, but I have never tried these star things. So let's taste a little tasty taste. Lime flavored. Still getting strong ginger vibes. I should have tried that one last. <laughs> if you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. If you like it, then you should have put a ring on it. <laughs> Let's try this one. Well, very chewy. Very chewy. Okay, wait a minute. I just thought back to the video that my mom said she was gonna send me, the gourmet snacks. How is this gourmet? All right, the last gourmet treat we have for today is the Bing Bing Cone Snack with Chocolate Flavored Filling. This actually looks so good. Um, and it kind of reminds me of like ice cream, but like with the top part just like chopped off. Oh, whoa, okay. So this is what it looks like. It smells good, so let's take a, a big crunch, ready? Wow. I feel like I've tried something like this before. Where have I tried like this before? The chocolate is really good. This is actually really good. Um, I think we got a good mix today. I feel like we got a real win with these Haribos and the Bing Bings. But um, let's just say uh, we'll be giving this one to you, Katie. <laughs> It is the next day and as you can tell I don't have makeup on our counters are kind of messy because we just finished doing a video where Spencer did my makeup and you know you're gonna have to check out the video to see how it went um, but we got another package here today <laughs> and Andre is making me try it this time. <laughs> to be fair though, I actually did try all the stuff that she got yesterday. He did try them off which camera. Which all were fine. The cereal was bleh, the ginger chew was nah. Ginger chew was spicy. Spicy. But the, <laughs> the gummies were really good. Are you ready to see what's inside this one? No. My mom texted me and she's like, just wait till you see what Monday's package is, which is in two days, so I'm a little nervous. Yeah. That one's gonna have some good things in it. Today's Saturday. All right, you ready? Oh, there's a couple things in here. And pull out the first one. The heck? <laughs> you came on a good day. <laughs> what is this? This is prepared shredded squid. Oh, that smells so fishy. It smells like fish food that you buy it smells at- like an aquarium. Yes, it smells like a fish food that you buy from the pet store. I like seafood though, so like maybe this won't be the worst. Take a little maybe, shred. Maybe it's just like squid <laughs> like squid jerky. That The shred just keeps going. Can I like rip off? It's like, this is like the consistency of like cheese. It literally smells like fish food. <laughs> Take a shred, cheers. <laughs> Is this human food? <laughs> Is it human food? I, 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 I. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Girl, no. Ew, it says you, you can eat prepared shred squid at any time, any place. Just open the bag and serve. It's also a convenient snack for picnics, hikes, and more. 
You like it? It's not the worst. All right, next snack. What is this gargantuan? What? Jacob's Twiglets? A whole lot of crunch and a whole grain lunch. Okay. What is this like a I chip feel like or maybe what is it's it? like crackers? Whoa! Oh, it's like a pretzel. What is this? Is like whole grain pretzels. That's what it looks like inside. Well, this smells like a coffee shop. It does smell like a coffee shop. It smells like it got burnt. <laughs> or it tastes like it. It tastes like it got burnt. It tastes like a burnt something. Why does it taste burnt? I'm gonna try another one. It tastes like it smells like a coffee shop. <laughs> Wait, the next one didn't taste as burnt. Keep trying them. Keep trying more. What even is this? What is that? Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh no. Oh, it's toxic oh, waste. No. Oh, I felt like an eyelash on my eyebolita. It's mega sour stuff. There's a scale on the back that's like how long you can keep it in your mouth is what you are. So if you can't keep it longer than 15 seconds, you're a total wuss. If you go to 30 seconds, you're a crybaby. 45 seconds is a toxie wannabe, and 60 seconds is a full toxie head. What the heck does that even mean? No clue. Okay, we should try to we should try to do it. I'm gonna start a timer. Okay. I don't wanna be a wuss. These are supposed to be more sour than warheads, aren't they? Yeah. They're toxic waste. They're so sour. I've never there, we did a toxic waste challenge and they gave me cankers. We just kept putting more and more and more in our mouth like chubby bunny. Because these are more sour than warheads. Yeah. Like you make you sound you make that sound like that's like way more sour than warheads. I think it is. I haven't tried it in a long time. Toxic waste. Uh, nuclear fusion is like. What color did I get? Ew. It's the different. It's like the. There's like flavor oh, mixes. Please, I get so, the green one. I'll try. I you. literally got green this strawberry. Is, Pineapple passion fruit if you want that one instead. Wait, can I choose a flavor? Yeah. I don't I literally grief is my like Now the question is is banana they're blueberry. more sour if they're more sour than warheads, do they have the same like like is it just straight sour taste for a while before like, I don't the remember. Fruit comes I through? Oh, my mouth is already watering. Because if it's like sour but you can actually taste the fruit flavor the whole time, I feel like that might be bearable. Alright, we gotta get a close cam on this actually. Because warheads just taste like straight like sour powder and it tastes like gross for a while yeah I don't want cheers thanks for coming on this video with me ready we're gonna start a timer to see if we're a total wuss i'm probably gonna be a total wuss man up come on let's do it mm. ready yeah set go It doesn't even kick in until like 15 seconds. Oh, yeah. I taste a banana in my actually. I'm surprised. Oh wow. It gets worse. Oh, it gets worse and worse. <laughs> it's like a reverse warhead. You get the fruit first and mm -hmm. then it like disintegrates into sour. Mm-hmm. At least it's like it's like layered. Like it goes back and forth between waves of sour and then like the fruit flavor. I don't think they're more sour than a warhead. Actually, yeah, I don't think so either. Here are my ratings for each of the products today. Fish food, burnt boys. Sour boys. <laughs> sour this sweet. Fash fishy boys, burnt boys, sour boys. Well, that's it for today's review. We'll see you on the next day when we get a new mystery package. I got another package and I am terrified for this one because my mom said the package coming on Monday is gonna be an interesting one and today is Monday and here it is. <laughs> Today's gourmet food is... Oh what? <laughs> it's a box! They look like chips. some point. I knew it was coming. Why do I have three of them? 
You thought these were normal chips. No, no, no. Let me introduce you to Cheddar Cricket Chips. I'm just gonna pretend like this is just a normal, a normal chip. I just, okay, they don't look weird, but I just can't get over the fact that they're made from crickets. This is what it looks like. It looks kinda like a Dorito chip, you know? But are every dot in this a cricket leg or like, <laughs> I'm so scared! Ah! Okay, <laughs> here we go. I'm just gonna do the whole thing. <laughs> I've been cookies before. Not bad. <laughs> it's actually... I don't think you'd be able to tell. Just had some cricket chips, just girly things. Love that. <laughs> um, and now I have three bags of them, so yay. The last package has arrived, and I'm so curious to see what it is, because it's shifting around in here quite a bit. Um, but I I already know, we had a crazy week this week with all the different snacks we've gotten, so we're gonna see if we're gonna end on a tasty note or a not so tasty note. Ooh, these look. Good, okay, so what we have today are Welch's fruit and yogurt snacks. This one is in mango peach, and this one is in blueberry acai. I feel like we have to try both of them. Mango peach fruit and yogurt? I've never heard of that before. This is what it looks like. They're like, hello? That's what it looks like. So it just looks like a fruit snack covered in yogurt, which makes sense. <laughs> okay, here we go. Wow! Thumbs up on that one. Let's try the blueberry acai one. Oh, the smell of this one though, it kind of smells like dirty diaper. Why does this smell weird? <laughs> the other one didn't smell bad. This one just smells a little, a little funky, a little off. Okay, what is it? Does it look the same? Kind of. Ew, it smells so gross. Oh. Okay, so it essentially looks the same, but instead it like looks like a blueberry covered in um, yogurt, but the smell is pretty gross. Let's, let's, let's see about the taste. That's what matters, right? Don't know how to feel about this one. I think I might like the mango one more. I feel like the mango one had more flavor to it. This one smelled genasty, had questionable flavor. This one does not smell that bad and is very strong flavor. So I think I would recommend this one more, but they, they were better than some other snacks that we've tried, like the squid. But anyway, you guys, that is going to be it for today's video. This was so much fun. Thank you, Mom, for sending me all these gourmet snacks. It was literally like Christmas, opening up these boxes every day and seeing what mystery package I was going to get. So if you guys like these um, blindfold mystery taste test videos, Make sure to thumbs it up and comment down below what you want to see next and subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!